Yeah, I'm in game mode. I got my game face. I'm ready to kill it. Cooking up everything inside skill. Yeah, toy, toy, three, zero. I'm gonna go off and kill some more shit. Even if it's a little bit more, but I don't give a fuck. I'm in game mode. Yeah, this is my game mode. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna talk my shit out like the guns for high life. Yeah, I'm gonna beat the shit out of the bosses like I'm a bad mutant. I muted my crap so much over the years. I'm not the same. Yeah, chameleon. Yeah, I gotta go build a crap. I'm sharing Minecraft. Yeah, I'm gonna bot that shit. Bitch, I'm in game mode. Watch it explode this shit. I'm gonna implode with the sickness. Yeah, I'm a victory of greatness. I'm in game mode. Game mode. Yeah, it's that game mode. Yeah, bitch, that game mode. Great ever do it like this what the fuck is up eh? but this motherfucker saying chris bring it back yeah another minecraft mod review so yeah today we're going to be reviewing a different mod today um so this mod is called um i, I forgot what it's called okay it's called the gla oh it's called gallosphere so gallosphere basically what it does it adds in different shit to the different uh underground on here so yeah, you got these different these different mods that, that do the biomes and everything. They put new biomes into the overworld and shit. Well, this one focuses on what's under underground, like new biomes underground and shit, um, which is why it's called the uh, Gallosphere. And uh, yeah, it adds in a couple of things. It adds in uh, a thing called a Sterling Helmet, which you can basically uh, craft with basically you just need a leather cap and a silver ingot, which basically... Um, you can get inside this mod, which basically, um, you find the silver ores, and you, you get the silver ores, and basically do some regular Minecraft shit, and, uh, you're able to do that, and get the silver ingots, and then you can make all this different armor, um, and the smithing table, so, yeah, you're gonna need to have this, uh, the smithing table, but, yeah, mainly it adds in stuff that's, like, underground and shit, so, that being said, we're gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna look around, see if there's, like, a ravine or something, because got, I gotta go underground to show you guys what this what this mod looks like. So, yeah, I need to find, like, an opening or something underground. Um, it doesn't have to be big. It, it, it could be big, but it has to be a, some sort of opening underground. Because that's the way to get into uh, the different caves and shit. Because that's how uh, the, the new caves works on uh, Minecraft. So, yeah, they'll have, like, a little thing that goes underneath. Not, not like that, though. Um, it has to be a little bit bigger. Because I want to show you guys... I want to show you guys what it looks like, cause I I I want to I want to show it off and showcase it on this mod, cause I found this mod on Curse Borge, uh, not that long ago, and I thought this looked pretty cool, so that's why I figured might as well check it out. Um, but yeah, mainly all the stuff they add in is underground. That's why I need to find an opening. Like it could be a, it could be a cavern. Um, it could be anything. It has it actually has to be a cavern, like a giant fucking either cavern or ravine. Um, or actually we could just dig down and see. Um, that were in creative mode, maybe. Uh, but I don't know, dude. I don't know. I've never tried this mod before. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to try to show you guys and, and, uh, show you guys what it looks like. So I guess we could just go ahead and, and, uh, mine down right here, like next to this giant fucking big ass tree right here. Um, let's see, let's actually see if it, if it actually spawns in down here. I don't know if it will. It might have. I don't know. Let's keep going down. All right, come on. I've got to have at least reached a little bit of it by now. Um, let's see. Is it down here? There's got to be some down here. Okay, it looks like it's not going to be down here. So I'm pretty sure, yep, it's not down there. Okay. Okay, so it's not down there. But you guys kind of get the gist of it. Um... So yeah, basically, I guess we're just gonna have to find a uh, a uh, one of the openings because that's usually um, when I whenever I play Minecraft, I find a giant opening and I'm able to find uh, I'm able to find uh, the different like underground shit and everything. So yeah, and this mod mainly adds in different biomes underground. So yeah, and and I'm talking about caverns like that, but not like that. It's it's difficult to explain, but yeah. Hold on, I'm actually gonna make a new world. I'm gonna make a new world. Let's make a new world. Um, let's make a new world. Let's just create a new world um, on creative mode. It, it don't matter. It don't really matter. So let's just go to creative mode. So there we go. Let's do that. There we go. Okay, so let's see if it actually works on this one. Um, because yeah, that world was fucking trash. <laughs> um, because yeah, I don't, I don't know, dude. Some worlds be like that. Some worlds they don't be uh, spawning in the uh, ravines and shit. But maybe this is 
maybe this this might work i don't know i've never tried this mod before but um yeah basically that's what uh uh gallo spear basically adds in is uh, different different biome types underground so hopefully we're able to run into some down here and looks like there is a giant ravine down here um let's see let's see if, if let's see if there's like a new biome down here i don't think there is though i don't think there is though um not really um, but yeah, basically it adds in like different biomes to the underground. Um, but yeah, you're just gonna have to, you're gonna have to test your luck with this. Like you're really gonna have to test your luck with this. Um, because yeah, sometimes it doesn't spawn in, sometimes it does. Um, but yeah, it, it, you gotta find, you gotta find the different caves. You gotta find them in your world and, uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely a fucking, it, it's a, it's, it's a process. But yeah, it looks like that maybe there's some down here. Um, but yeah, basically you gotta find these giant fucking caverns like this, um, that go all the way down. So it looks like maybe I found, uh, maybe I stumbled up on one, I don't know. Um, maybe, I don't know, fuck, I don't even know. I think it's just like a, yeah, let's say another giant ravine, but yeah. So basically, yeah, it adds in like different biomes. I can't really find one, I don't know, like, dude, they, sh they should be spawning in like down here somewhere. Um, but yeah, basically you just got to find these huge caverns and test your luck with it. Like there's no, there's nothing I can really say about it. Um, not anything else I can really say about it, but, um, yeah. And basically, yeah, you can take, uh, you can make leather armor and, uh, yeah, leather horse armor. You can basically take that, put that in the smithing table with the silver ingot. And then, yeah. So yeah, I just thought I'd go ahead and show you guys. That. I guess I can show you guys the rest of everything that's in here. So, um, yeah, there's different, there's different types of biomes that it adds in underground so yeah it mostly focuses on underground and add stuff like underground and everything but like i said it's, it's a it's a dice roll it really is a dice roll um because some worlds they don't they don't be spawning in anything like sometimes they won't be spawning in anything <laughs> um but it is what it is you know sometimes they don't sometimes they do sometimes they don't um but it's all depending on how you look and uh yeah, and, and what and what and what uh, things you look at. So, yeah, and and yeah, there's different biomes underground and shit because the new cave uh, thing. So, yeah, it will kind of blend in with that same uh, concept too. So, yeah, it will, it will though. But yeah, it's just there's like fucking yeah. You're just gonna have to. You're just gonna have to try your dice. You're just got to roll a dice with it. Um, but yeah, <laughs> there's nothing else I can really say about that. Um. But yeah, yeah, like I said, you're just gonna have to try your your luck with it because some worlds they they don't have it. But um, yeah, it's just like yeah, I just don't understand, dude. I don't understand sometimes these mods they be they be doing like that. They they be doing they be doing shit like that. But hey, it is what it is. At least I tried to look for one. So um, yeah, <laughs> fucking a for effort, right? Um, but yeah, I guess I can show you guys the rest of everything that's in here. So. Um, they got a, they got a, they got a sparkle and a specter, it looks like. Um, so sparkle, they look like this. So basically, I think these are like, uh, the counterparts to, uh, uh what, what are they called? Uh, the axolotls. Yeah, these are like the counterparts to the axolotls. And then you got the uh, specter one. Um, and these little specters, they fly, they fly underground and shit. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, um, that they added these in as like a mod. That's pretty insane, but... Um, yeah, and then you can also, uh, get these, uh, you can make these golden, uh, uh what is it called, uh, Corsipus? I can't even pronounce that. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then they got, like, these different clusters they add in, um, like the, uh, like the amethyst clusters, you know, um, but yeah, they basically add in allure clusters, lemonite clusters, and, uh, aura ringers, you can make aura ringers, which basically you just need blocks of silver, um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool extensive mod, it adds in like different biomes to, uh, the thing, and they can also make a thing called a chandelier, which basically you just need, uh, bottles of specters, and then you make that, and they can make a little chandelier, um, which I'm gonna go ahead and place that down, I guess, um, and show you guys at least something, <laughs> um, but yeah, it looks like that. It looks something like that. So it looks pretty cool. And it emits light, I believe. Um, so yeah, I think it does. Does it, does it emit light? Let's see. Let's go to let's go to time set night. Um, oh yeah, it does. Oh yeah, it does. Look at that, dude. Look at that, dude. It's all it's all it's all shining in the in the dark. That's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, and then you got these little clusters. I'm guessing these clusters are like the amethyst. You just find them in a, in a G node and. Uh, 
you're able to find them and break them. And so yeah, it basically extends off of what the uh, caves update added for Minecraft. So yeah, and you guys kind of get the gist of it. So I don't really gotta explain it too much. Um, and then you also got the uh, you got the combustion table, which you're gonna also make. Um, which basically, I'm guessing it has to do something with explosives. Um, but yeah, and then I think that's also how you're able to make a thing called a silver bomb. Um, but yeah, the silver bomb is basically, I'm guessing they're like TNT, so let me go ahead and throw one real quick. Um, so yeah, basically it's like TNT, it just blows up everything. Um, let me, let me actually do that again, let me do that again, let me do that again. Okay, there we go. Um, but yeah, it basically, I mean it does blow up, but I don't know why it doesn't blow up on that, but hey, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, these little silver bombs, they blow up your, they blow up everything, so... I mean, uh, they can be used for pretty good weapons, I guess. And they also got these things called glow fairs, which basically has a crafting recipe for it. You need to have glowing sacks, copper, gunpowder, and you get a ball of specters, which basically, I'm guessing what you do is you take the, uh, you find these specters and you, and you get like a uh, empty water bottle. I mean, let me see. Or just like an empty, empty glass bottle. So let's see. Like this. Oh, and I think you, I think you just right click on them like this and then you just like... Yeah, yeah, okay, that's how you do it. So basically, um, you just right click on it and then it gives you uh, the specter. So basically, you capture the specters and you put them in a glass bottle and uh, that, and then you're able to make all that other stuff. So it's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, this, this is a nice little mod they've added so far. Um, and then they also got a thing called a warped anchor, which I don't know. I'm not 100% sure like what, what it does exactly. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of shit that they added to this mod. Um, but yeah, it's basically uh, they like new new biomes. So basically, I'm looking at the uh, website right now. So yeah, the new biomes it adds is crystal canyons and lichen caves. The new mobs it adds are the sparkle and spectra, which I showed you guys already. Um, the new resources they added the uh, allurite shards, uh, the luminaire shards, the sh the silver ingots, which I already showed you guys. Um, the lichen mushrooms, which basically the lichen mushrooms. Uh, they look like, uh, let's see, Lichen Mushroom, let's see, Lichen, Lichen Mushroom, uh, let's see, I'm gonna look it up, I'm gonna look it up, um, okay, Lichen, okay, I'm just gonna look up Mushroom, yeah, so basically it adds in, like, new stuff, I'm guessing they're adding more to it, um, but yeah, this is probably still, like, a work in progress, um, but yeah, basically it adds in new new stuff like silver bombs, glow flares. Um, they're adding more stuff into it probably. Um, but yeah, it, they dude, this mod is still kind of new. Um, it came out not that long ago, so yeah, it, it, they might add more stuff. They might they might uh, add, they might they might I don't know, dude. Um, but yeah, and then you can also make these little things called lamps. Ooh, nice. You can take uh, amethyst and you can make uh, amethyst lamps. You can make. Uh, you can make uh, allurite lamps, which basically um, are the same recipe. You just take uh, allurite shards, you put that with glowstone, and you make these different lamps. It's pretty cool, though. I mean, I mean it's pretty cool. I vibe with it. I vibes with it. <laughs> um, and they can make uh, luminaire ones, which basically, um, I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't even know, dude. I don't even know how to pronounce half the shit on here. But hey, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, look at that. Oh my god, dude. That, that is insane. I like it. <laughs> I like the new looks they added to this. Like, that's crazy. But yeah. And they also have uh, amethyst. Ooh, you can actually make uh, stairs and stuff out of amethyst. That's crazy. Amethyst bricks. What? You can make amethyst bricks. What? That's crazy. Like they, they. It's like a new mechanics to the game. That's crazy. Um, and they can also make blocks of raw silver. And yeah, there's a lot of shit to it. There's a lot of shit to it. But yeah, like I said, it's basically like a chance that it's. I think it's a small chance that you're gonna be able to find one of these biomes on here, um, in this mod. But. Yeah, you just gotta roll your dice with it. You gotta roll your dice with it, and eventually you'll find one. Uh, but yeah, anyway, th th I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um, pretty well, I think I pretty well went through most of the majority of the mod. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to check out this mod, go ahead and do so. Um, definitely, it's a dice roll if you guys want to find a biome to this, because I don't know exactly how to find it. But all I do know is they're located underground. So if I were you, I would start digging underground and keep looking around and see where maybe one might be because like i said it's a dice roll so you really don't know um with these different worlds because some of these worlds they end up trying to fuck you you know um i've had i've had minecraft worlds where where i created them they've literally put me on a fucking island 
with the one little fucking tree. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta kind of roll a dice with this one. But um, yeah, if you guys want to check it out, my link will be in the description so you guys can download it and try it for yourselves. Um, and also, um, if you guys have not followed me or or, or uh, you know subscribe to the channel yet, go ahead and do so. Um, let's try to get to the 150 subscribers by April. I know we can do it. We just gotta come into the video like we've been like we've been doing on here. And um, yeah, that's all I gotta say for this video. Just about fucking saying crazy now, and I will see you guys on the next Minecraft mod review.